हेलो एवरी वन वेलकम बैक टू द पिनगन कोडर्स वेलकम टू द थर्ड पार्ट ऑफ द सीरीज वेयर वी बिल्ड एन आयोनिक न्यूज एप्लीकेशन यूजिंग आयोनिक सो इन द लास्ट पार्ट वी हैड ऑलरेडी डिस्कस्ड हाउ वी हैड मेड अ न्यूज कार्ड कॉम्पोनेंट एंड वी वर एबल टू शो द इमेजेस एंड द टाइटल एंड अदर डिटेल्स नाउ वी विल बी यूजिंग न्यूज ए पी आई टू मेक अ सर्विस एंड शो द एक्चुअल न्यूज फ्रॉम द ए पी आई एंड शो द रिजल्ट हेयर सो फॉर दैट यू नीड टू रजिस्टर विथ न्यूज ए पी आई न्यूज ए पी आई इज इन वेबसाइट वेयर यू कैन गेट द न्यूज रिलेटेड टू डिफरेंट आर्टिकल्स एंड देर आर डिफरेंट कैटेगरीज अवेलेबल हेयर सो यू विल बी नीडिंग टू लॉग इन यू विल नीड टू गेट ए पी आई की वेयर यू विल हैव टू रजिस्टर एंड देन आफ्टर रजिस्टरिंग यू विल बी एबल टू लॉग इन एंड गेट द नेटवर्क की फ्रॉम हेयर आई ऑलरेडी हैव लॉगड इन एंड गॉट ए नेटवर्क की नेटवर्क की सो विच दैट आई विल बी यूजिंग इन माई सिस्टम सो आफ्टर यू गेट न्यूज ए पी आई की यू गो बैक टू योर वी एस कोड एंड ए देयर यू नीड टू पेस दिस पेस दिस ए पी आई की इन साइड योर इन्वायरमेंट्स फ्रॉम वेयर वी विल बी यूजिंग इट इन साइड द एप्लीकेशन सो गो टू द इन्वायरमेंट फोल्डर एंड इन द इन्वायरमेंट डॉट टी एस फाइल विच इज द नॉन प्रॉड इन्वायरमेंट यू विल बी एबल टू सी दैट इट्स प्रोडक्शन फॉल्स हेयर यू विल नीड टू कॉपी द ए पी आई की सो विच आई ऑलरेडी हैव इट सो आई विल कॉपी माई सो जस्ट एंटर दैट वैल्यू सो वी विल बी कीपिंग अ बेस यू आर एल ऑल्सो सो बेस यू आर एल वे विच वील बी यूजिंग फॉर न्यूज ए पी आई टू कॉल द न्यूज ए पी आई सर्विसेस वील बी यूजिंग दिस सो द बेस यू आर एल विल बी न्यूज ए पी आई डॉट ऑर्ग स्लैश वी टू विच इज द ए पी आई वर्जन एंड टॉप हेडलाइंस सो दिस वी विल बी गेटिंग द top headlines so what what all categories are present you can watch from the see from the documentation where you will have everything in top headlines so right now i'm using this top headlines api endpoint so i and then i'll be passing the required parameters and the different categories in different service in different pages so that i'll be able to access all these seven categories now my base url is set and then i'll i'll set a api key so the api key which i have uh, received i have just added a random number but you can add your own api key here so i'll add my api key which i'll be using for service calls so this is my api key now the environment setup is done now we need to generate a new service from where we will be able to call the news api service so the command for generating a new service is ng generate service and the service name we will keep it as services we'll keep all the service in the services folder services slash news api and let it run so as you can see it it created a new services folder where we have the news api dot service dot ts here we will be writing the news api service so i'll go go to this and here i'll define a variable called top headlines path top headlines path which will come from my environment so environment dot uh, base url and after we will be defining a new new function which will say get top headlines so i'll be more precise and type as get top country headlines and in the parameter i'll be passing the country which will be string and a category so this category parameter allows me to use only one function to have all the different api calls from different pages and we don't need to write functions for a different categories so inside the get top country headlines we will be requiring to get the response from our uh, news api so i'll pass return this dot http dot get and where i'll pass the url so this dot top headlines path plus country category and we will have the uh, a page size so we'll pass a parameter page size so that we get so we have this dot top headlines path and then we will be passing the country 
country category page size 10 since we want only to display the top 10 news for each category and the api key we get from the environment which we have written here now it throws an error that says http does not exist and we can use this by passing a constructor for http so i'll pass private http and we have the it's a type of http client now just uh, we'll import this http client so I'll, Im I'll import the http client from angular common http this is done okay now you will be able to see it properly so now uh, if we want to have more type safety and because we are using TypeScript, so I should specify what type of this HTTP get will return the object as since we want to bind it to our view, we will be trying to have a model for our news return news where which we will get from the news. So for that copy this JSON and then I will convert it into proper TypeScript, which can be done online from many websites so this i already have done it and i will be creating a new model which i will be storing in the interfaces i'll create a new folder called interfaces so in the app i'll have one new folder and i'll call it interfaces and here i'll have a new file which i'll name as news response dot ts so I already have my uh, news response so I'll just copy paste it. This is the news response which you will be able to get it. So if you want to know how to get this, you will either you can copy this from the GitHub code uh, which, which for which the URL is there present in the description. From there you can either copy this or if you want to generate learn how to do this. So I'll tell you. So you can just copy paste this. Uh, entire response so i have all the json data so i'll just copy it and i'll search for json to ts interface and go to the first website json to ts.com where i'll paste this json and i'll the generated chat type script i'll get it so i can copy this export interface source article root object yeah so this is all done so this is what I have source, articles entity and the root object I have changed it to news response. Now I can choose the return type of this news API service. So the news API will be returning a observable and the observable will be of type uh, news response and we need to add this in the HTTP get also. So the get uh, we will be getting a type of news response. So this completes our service file. So now we can use the service in our components. I'll go to my folder and there is the folder.page.ts which is the main component which connects all the different uh, like it gets the ID and then uh, accordingly it routes to the specified folder page. So I'll go to the folder.page.ts and there I'll add a function to call this service. So I'll add a new function which is get top headlines and here I'll call the news API service. So this dot news API service. So before calling the news API service, I'll need to declare it in the constructor. So I'll have, have it. So I'll have the private news API service and it is of type news API service save it so this dot news api service dot get top country headlines and the parameters i'll pass is the first country name so the country name for me is india so i'll be passing in which is the two letter code so you can pass us for us or accordingly your country and then this dot folder so this dot folder was the second parameter which represents which uh, which id that means the category we are going to get from the API. I'll map it and since the response consists of many different things such as the status, total results, status, total results and then the articles array comes. I don't want the status and total results. I want only the articles array. So I'll map it so that it only shows me the articles array. So I'll map the result as to result 
dot articles and then I'll subscribe this code block subscribe and I will initialize my news object news so I'll give that to this dot news list is equals to news now I don't have this news list I'll declare a news list so news list and news list is of type it consists of all the news array so we see in the interfaces the news articles is of type articles entity array so I'll just copy this and it's of type articles entity and I'll just import it map I can import it from rxjs import map from rxjs operators so now if we call this get top headlines then we will be able to get the top headlines of that particular category which we are getting from in the ng on init method so the next step would be to call this code to call this function so i'll just call this this dot get top headlines now this is done we can see our app is also running i have running it and then so there are some changes still left so now if i go go to my ionic application and then i reload it let me see what is in console so there is an null injector error for http client so we are getting this null injector error that says that http client module is not available so to solve this what we will add is we will add the http client module in our app module.ts so go to your app module ts and then here after the app routing module we will import http client module as well this should hopefully solve the issue and let's see yes so now we can see that um, it's working but still we are able to not get any data here because the data binding is not there so we'll go to our folder page html and in our folder page.html we have this app news card which is the news card component so now instead of ha having this news card alone we will add a list of news cards so i'll add our div div id equals container and we will add a we will add a ion spinner so ion spinner is used to show the loading icon so ng and there we will put a ngf condition so ngf condition is used to see if if we have the news available then we will either load the news or till that time we will show a progress bar so we will type here is not is a news list so we will directly check if a news list is still available or not and then we will close this ion spinner and then the div is closed after that if we have news list then we can either put the news here so div star ng if equals if we have news list then we will put a div and then ng4 so ng4 so for each news i uh, for each news we will be creating a new card component so let news of news list and here we will be passing that so app news card and here i'll be passing the news and then app news card so now we get an error that this news variable is not present in the app news card so we'll need to uh, put uh, send the news from the parent component to the child component using input so i'll go to the news card component and here i'll declare a new input and that is news which will be of type news response so and the news response type uh, the type of the news can be seen from news response.ts so it's a single articles entity so i'll just copy this and then in the news card i'll just paste it so it's an article entity we don't need to do anything else in this component everything will be done in the template so now we are sending this news so we will be receiving it in the news card component html 
and in the HTML we can use this. So for the IM card, so now we want that whenever we click a card, so uh, the you, the new actual content of the news should be opened in a new tab. So for that, I'll insert a link. So href to the news URL. So I'll do as interpolation here, and it will be news dot URL. And we want to open it in a new web page. So target is equals to blank. It will open in a new tab. And then I'll add a rel is equals to no opener and no referer for security purposes. So now every time if someone clicks the cart, then they will be re redirected to the news article. So image source. This we can now replace with IN image and put a condition. Sometimes the news API doesn't send me images. So I'll check if ng if if they I have the news URL to image. So news dot URL to image. If I have that, then only show the image, else else nothing. Then source equals to Source will be news dot url to image. Okay, after that the subtitle is destination is subtitle also we can get it from the news API. So I'll put it. So since it can be null, I'll add an optional chaining here. So news dot source. So you can refer to the app for whatever I'm typing the news dot url url to image. It's all available in the news API where you will be able to URL to image published content, everything you will be able to see. So news source and then source dot name. And now we have the title where I'll be showing the news, news title. So news dot title. After that here, I'll show the news description. So I'll remove that and news dot description I'll add it. So this completes my iron card layout mm, getting some error okay so ion image i have to close it so i'll close this ion image tag and now it's all yeah now if i go to the news api app i can see it's coming the application is running fine and if i go to no sources network i will see that the api has been called with all the parameters country india category general page size and my api key and i am getting all the data 10, 10 articles. So this is the general category. I'm getting everything with all the images loaded. And now if I click on any of the article, it will open in a new page where I'll be able to see the news. Similarly, I will be able, if I go to business, a new API will be called. So, and then we will have all the articles related to that. Go to sports, we go to technology, and also you will be able to see that okay if i do a throttling to slow 3g and then i try it so this functionality i'll show how the loader behaves so general you will be able to see a loader coming in and as soon as the api call gets completed then we will have uh, the images and everything loaded so i'll remove this the slow 3g to no throttling this complete so this completes our news application and we have it all ready so please suggest if you want any more features in this news application and for more such categories and tutorials please subscribe to the penguin coders where you will be able to find more interesting tutorials on the way thank you